Hey guys, it's Todd here. In this video, I'm going to be playing the short game on itch.io called Planet Life. So the description of this game is, in Planet Life, you are born again as a planet. Being a planet in space can be very lonely, but fortunately, there is life out there. Search the cores of the universe for new friends who will help you on your quest to become a happy little place to live. Manage your resources and upgrade tools to advance. Fight your way down a deep, deep dungeon leading to the core of yourself and gains the respect of mysterious space gods. So that's the description. There is only four comments and each of them said it was a short game, so I'm going to trust the comment section. But never trust the YouTube comment section. <laughs> Alright, so. Hello. Hello. It's all totally dark here. Is anything here at all? No. Wait. Something is here. Bang! Hey, look! A beautiful planet appeared. Is that you? Hey, where's the no option? I'm right here. I'm not in the game. Where's the no option? Fine. Yes. That's pretty cool. Being a planet must be super exciting. You are so big and round and full of life. Life. Oh, it's like a sad face. <laughs> I'm sad. Oh, what's that? There's no life on your surface except for the entire planet. Well, that figures. You were only just creating that big explosion. Hey, that was too fast. I thought I missed something. But don't worry about it. There's probably plenty of life out in the universe. No doubt. Happy, yay. Why don't you go take a look? Explore. There's something out there in the distance. Asteroid. You reach the huge potato-shaped chunk of asteroid. Nothing is there except for a small robot. Back or talk to the ro talk to the robot. The robot seems happy to see you. It says that it was just enjoying the sunshine, and its name is Burger. Hey, Burger, <laughs> make me a burger, please. It tells you that it can't remember much of anything since all of its memory was on a USB stick. And somehow it has got to that USB stick misplaced. How unfortunate. Take Burger with you. We'll leave him on. The I'm taking a robot with me. If you find a robot on an asteroid created by an alien civilization, you take it. Burger chirps happily as he softly lands on your surface. Okay. You're a beautiful little planet hanging out in a cozy little solar system. What do you do now? Your surface or the asteroid? Wait, what does it want me to do? Go back to the asteroid? Okay, I'll go back up. Oh, okay, let's go to my surface. So oh, there's a lot. Okay. On your surface, there are beautiful lush forests and vast oceans. Burger is chirping through the forest. Go back to space. Talk to Burger. Talk to Burger. Burger is happy to see you. It tells you that it can, in fact, be quite productive. What do you want Burger to do? I want to hear its secret. Burger's telling you a secret. The asteroid is actually a giant Cocoa Pops. What a revelation. Well, Burger. Anything else? Chop wood. One wood a second. Burger's chirping happily as it is game to work. And look, there it is, right there. Burger, can you also dig for gold? Yeah. Oh, I can only do one thing at a time. Okay. So I need 20 wood. Okay. Oh, I can scroll up and down. Totally forgot. Hey, that's pretty cool. About. A game by Northway, designed by Christian Lumark. Backhand Christine Anderson. Design direction, Mike. Okay, just talking about the creators, I see. Back to the game. Oh, cool, it got materials as I was waiting. Cool. Workshop. Shack you need to build before you can build everything else. Got it. In this workshop, you can build anything, as long as it's, it's one of the few options below. Oh, wow, that's... wow. <laughs> okay, nipple axe. Yes, axe upgraded, Minecraft style. Can I do anything else? Hey, Burger, what you do? Ooh. Burger tells you that it has found a strange dungeon. Oh, there it is while well, working. Show me the dungeon. It's the entrance to a dungeon leading into you? Because I'm the planet? What? You'll need somebody to go down there because you obviously can't because I'm the literal planet. Hear good news? Oh, cool. Burger seems in particularly good mood today. It shows you a handful of some glittery stuff. It's stardust! Yeah! What everybody's made of. Yay. Burger tells you that it won it on the slot machine. <laughs> you should give it a try. I didn't build the slot machine yet. Alright, get the stardust. ka -ching. Back to the workshop. Yes, I would like to upgrade my axe, please. Burger have a 50% chance of mining one gold a second. Okay, I guess you'll do gold now. I require you to get some gold. What says? Is that the cocoa beans, puffs, whatever they called it? Alright, so this game's gonna have a lot of patience in it, as I can tell. I'm liking this game so far. This game is just simple. These flash beans are just super simple. That's what I love about them. House for friends. If you want anybody living on you, they need some place to live. Well, how are we supposed to get people on here? Like, building a house is not just gonna get random humanoid figures to just spawn on this planet in Minecraft style. It doesn't work that way. This is in Minecraft. Boom! Axe upgraded for the third time. Yes. Now I just need to get all this stuff. This might take a little bit. Oh, I can explore back in space? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, 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 oh
You see a small object in the distance. Is it like a flying saucer with a tiny gnome like guy seeing it smiling? It's a freak. Check it out. Space Ben is sitting in his space shop looking at you. Do you want to buy something? Do you? Well, oh, it's a ton of USB sticks. Hey, I found something in the asteroid. Automatic swirly straw. Sucks up one cocoa a second. Ah, okay. Don't confuse me with a million things every second, please. I need cocoa beans right now. Yes! Suck that cocoa. Because it's a straw. I get it. Hey, I'm about to upgrade again. Look at that. Well, that was quick. All right. Hello, crazy guy. I'm back at the shop, even though I don't need anything. <laughs> buy the house for friends. You don't have any friends yet. Sad. Very sad. So, was that just like a waste of money, or can I do something here? Did I just waste a ton of money? Now I can get to wait another million years? Oh, great. I thought that house was gonna get people, because it's a video game. That's how games work. Sometimes. Ooh, a star map. What would this do? A very mystical star map. Attempt to read it? Oh, yeah. You found a freezer floating in space. Check it out. Are you really want to open the freezer? Yeah, what? There's someone in there. Cryogenically frozen. <gasps> it's a furious bull man. Someone clearly wanted this guy to cool it. He screams that his name is Derek and is really cold. However, he joins your space quest. Okay. Does that mean he's leaving in the house? What? Well, the bull man. He's gotta be living in the house now. I just got him. Where's he living? He's still in space? <laughs> What's going on? Health potion? Oh my gosh. Another star map? My goodness. Feels like 50 health. I'm guessing the bull man's gonna be the person that goes in the dungeon. Okay, so he is. Okay. His health is like 50-50 and he's carrying 0 out of 1 health. Let's go down to the dungeon level 1 or upgrade Derek. Okay. Upgrade his strength, yeah. He's just cost cocoa beans, so it doesn't really matter. Alright, so I upgrade his strength. I'm gonna go down to the dungeon level 1. Oh my god, we're Oh! Oh. Okay. He beat up seven jerks. His health is like 50-50 right now, but I'm cool. Go deeper. That's enough. Okay, you need a chill. <laughs> no wonder why he was in a freezer. Upgrade max health. Yeah. Actually, no. I'm saving my wood for better axe. Bam. Go drill upgraded. Why not a thousand? Why not 999? Okay. Alright, so it's up to a 60% chance of mining one gold per second, but it's basically doing that right now. Alright, I'm gonna send him back to the dungeon again, because I upgraded some of his strength, so I hope he'll do fine. Alright. Oh no, R. Ooh. Derek. Alright, planet guy, I think I'm done this for. How did it go? I'm so pumped, I beat up seven jerks. My health is like 50 50 right now, but I'm cool. Go deeper. Um. I guess go deeper. Oh, he's done with this for. How did it go? Oh. I'm so pumped, I beat like 10 jerks. My health is like 50 50 right now. But I'm cool. I also found this small star present. Open it. What did I get? Let's open this bad boy. Gig explosion. 30 wood. Well, that's all. Go deeper? This is level 3. Okay, I'm not gonna send him farther than level 3. Alright, I'm not sending him farther than level 3. I don't want him to die. Alright, so that was kind of interesting. I wonder if it just goes on forever, because I see in the, one of the comments it said, Does the dungeon go forever until you uh, basically can't just get enough wood or whatever i don't know resources to go farther something like that because that's what i heard well wow, i've been waiting for so long already this is taking like forever to do i thought this could be a short game i've been here for at least 20 minutes already and i've not gotten that far yet Oh, I just sent him into the dungeon. He actually lost three health even though it's level one. Oh, okay all right so i guess he can oh oh so one cocoa is one health. Oh, well, I already have enough cocoa. I think, pretty sure I do so. I don't think his health will be a problem. But I think I have to like, send him out of the cave before I can heal him. That's the thing. So now I can see the health potions. Why they're useful. Oh, okay, I'm guessing there's a, this is the last upgrade for the axe as well. Okay. Oh boy, this is going to take a while. Yes, I will buy this health potion. Okay, I guess there's infinite of them. Okay. Oh, so now when I go to the dungeon, I got to level 5 and found this ladder. So it just goes to level 5 automatically. Oh, so is that just going to be like every 5 levels then? Okay. Yo, what just happens if this guy dies? That's my question. Yep, so it is every 5 levels. Okay. Whoa, who's there? What is it? Hey, boss, there's this dino weirdo kind of thing down here. Meet dino thing? This is an ancient juice saurus. Is that even a real thing? It must have gotten stuck down here while all the dinos were busy getting extinct. You make a great friend. I got the friend! Okay, so he's at the friend's house. Go see what he's working on. Alright, I made some progress there. So what's he doing? He's spewing juice over the place that somehow gives you one cocoa a second. Alright, so I'm getting more cocoa. Alright then. 
Finally got all the upgrades for the axe and stuff. Alright, so now what's my main thing I gotta do? Because I was waiting for like 20 minutes for all this stuff. And I don't remember what my main thing was that I'm going to do. Yeah, what is the main thing that I'm trying to do right now? I don't even know. Maybe it's the, uh, I guess it's this star map I'm trying to get. Alright, let's see what the star map gets me this time. I found something very stupid looking. Check it out. Oh, it's another planet. Look at that. The rather stupid looking planet is an eye avoiding... Wait, is avoiding eye contact with you. After the initial shyness, it offers to trade. After all, it's not every day you meet a fellow planet. Yeah. Okay, buy gold. What is it? Exchange for 400 cocoa. Well, sure, I have so much cocoa. All right, then what about the wood? Exchange for 25 gold or 100 cocoa. All right, well, this just made it easier. Buy cocoa, I'm... All right, then. Well, this is gonna be faster. I could buy the red USB stick. You plug the USB stick into Burger. He beeps and chirps as he remembers. As a young robot, he used to work at an ice cream store with his Melty Fellow. Meet Melty Face. You meet Melty Face. He is dripping all over the place. He would make a great friend. Yes. All right, so he's at the house. What's up? He's producing five wood a second. Oh, okay. So now everything's going up at once. Okay. Ten Stardust. Okay. All right, guys. Well, I've never done this before, but I'm have to make a part two to this i've never done a part two to anything before so yeah i'm gonna see how it goes and make a part two and just yeah so anyway thank you for watching if you like this video make sure you like comment and subscribe if you aren't already any video suggestions comment below hope to see you all more and goodbye